Lego Indiana Jones 2 walkthrough for nexonwalkthroughs.com. Cave Capers level, and this one was a little bit annoying to find at first, but once you do, it's like, oh wow, I can't believe I missed it. Anyway, it's all the way down over here behind the level pretty much, or sort of hidden in the level. You see it pretty easily if you're flying around in the flying saucer. And you're gonna need a person with a spear and a girl. And once you, if you, and just so everyone knows, if they're doing it in the particular order that I was doing it in, this would be the last one. Uh, so this will get you all 10 of the treasure chests. But this one is actually a really, well, I guess all the bonus levels are pretty easy. So, <laughs> anyway, uh, uh, if you remember, to, like, you can use Indiana Jones' but to destroy things really, really easily. Although you've probably <laughs> known that for, like, years by now. So, uh, you're gonna need to get the guy with the gun over here because, well, actually, I lied. You're gonna need to get the platform up so you can get the water bottle so you can put out the fires over there. And using the whip will make this go a little tiny bit faster just because it makes getting the water bottles a little bit easier. And this one, uh, it's probably better if you put out all the fires before you try to walk over but you know I don't think you have to put out every single fire and then come over here keep putting up platforms just so everyone can get uh, get through for this you're gonna need uh, uh, a torch for this I think uh, well you're gonna have to destroy this oh shoot it open up the gate get to the other side and there would be the torch. And the torch will go out after a while, but usually it's not fast enough for you have to really worry about anything. And I think I end up dying here, yep. But yeah, uh, the torches will stay with you for a lot longer than you'd think. Oh, well, I mean a lot longer. Blah, 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 blah. Like, it, the torch's time doesn't run up fast enough, so there isn't really a timer. Never mind, just forget I said anything. So anyway, I blow up the dynamite and the radius is pretty huge explosive radius and if you're on one of those steps I think it'll kill you so step away from that but you get a bunch of studs from it so that's good I guess and then there's the two buttons that you're gonna need to get on and if you get on one the other guy should follow and that will lower those two platforms and you're going to need the fire and I just got both of them uh, I just got both of these characters. I just made both of these characters get water bottles just so I could put out the fire a little bit more than... And I completely missed that time so it was kind of a waste to get the second character the fire. And I just... And it's probably best on a little block to destroy everything. But again, you don't have to destroy every single fire there, just uh, two of them. Or a middle one and one of the side ones just so you can get through. So yeah, just do that. Go get the artifact or treasure chest and you're done.